Hello again, and here we are with our maths quiz. Um, we're going to now look at putting a level two in. And I'm going to show you a little trick which will save you a lot of time. We could go through all of this coding again, but actually what I'm going to do is click on the top of the loop that I want to copy, right click, duplicate, and it gives me the whole of that code below that. And then I'm just going to drop that onto the bottom. So now we need to just move down. It's got quite a lot of code. And I'm going to change this for um, into something else. I want to I want to make it a subtraction. So one of the things I'm going to do first, because I don't really want to go into minus numbers at the moment, I'm going to say that number one is from 11 to 20. Um, so we always know that we will be in a positive number rather than a negative number because uh, it's 11 to 20 take and taken away from that 1 to 10. Um, so I need to change this. It says what is number one added to number two. So I need to change that and it needs to be what is a number two subtracted. I can spell from number one. What is number two subtracted from number one? Now, this is not going to work because we have the answer equals number one plus number two. So we need to take that part out and I'm going to drop that out of the way. Go back to my operators. Now, what do I need here? See if you can fix this bit um, and have a go by pausing me now. And seeing how you get on and i'll wait for a few seconds and you can play it see whether you've done it in the same way as me you might have found a better way to do it so maybe you're back or maybe you just carried on listening to me but anyway uh the we take the subtraction the one with the minus sign drop it into there and then simply put number one in the first one so the answer equals number one minus number two um, and the rest of it can all stay the same or you can play around with it. You can change the scoring, that sort of thing. It's up to you. What I would like to do, though, is for my sprite, sprite to announce that it is time for level two. So I'm going to go to looks going to drop in a speech and say now for level two exclamation mark. Right. So hopefully now say in between. So let's have a go at our game and see how we're getting on. So there we are, 13, I've only got 30 seconds, I must remember. Um, and then the next one, I'm going to say 7. Next one, 11. Okay, now for level 2, excellent, so that's worked. And what is number 1, no, what is number 2 subtracted from number 1? So the answer would be 17. Good, that's correct. Let's get the next one wrong. So let's make this 3. Ah, it did game over just before, but it would have said bad luck. Try another one. Um, but all of that seems to be working now. So have a go and you can put several uh, levels in. If you do, you're going to need to give more time. Um, you can put lots of different levels in. You can do multiplication, subtraction, uh, more complicated additions. Division doesn't really work with this because you go into lots of decimals, which uh, makes it quite tricky. Um, so. Then there may be a way you think of the numbers that you ask as to whether you can make that happen. Um, there is a way of doing it, which is much more complex. OK, so uh, thanks for watching and look forward to seeing you next time.